Well, welcome back to Dobbo's Fishing Adventures. Can you guess where I am? Yeah, that's it. Southbourne, here we go. Let's give it a crack. Uh, literally just got down here. Uh, I haven't got the rods out yet. Don't really know what I'm gonna go for, who cares? As long as it swims, as long as it comes out of the water, happy days. That is my uh, target for tonight, just to catch. God, I tell you what, it's sweltering down here. All changed tomorrow though. A bit cooler weather. Um, been cooler all week, much better. But yeah, so hold on, let me let me go. Oh, sorry, let me just turn you around. That's it. You don't want to look at my ugly mug. So here we go. Bournemouth down there. Happy days. Sun's out. It's absolutely roasting. Might have to take my shoes and socks off in a minute. Whew, it is warm. So I haven't got the uh, pen casting specials on yet. Um, I have literally uh, a friend of mine uh, told me where to get some uh, new uh, mag dials for it. So that's what I'm going to uh, wait for. I've ordered them. Should be here next week. And hopefully get rid of that horrible, uh, crappy, big old casting knob off it. And uh, yeah you'll be able to enjoy them then so i've got the next best thing if not the best thing i've got the abu six and a half tsrs absolutely bulletproof reels superb hasn't got the retrieve but that doesn't matter doesn't matter about south form you don't need a fast uh, reel to get your bait in here there's no snags nothing so i just want either maximum distance or i'll drop one in short one of the two so usual tactics tonight, so I've got two hook loop, three hook clip down, then I'll go for pulley panel or an up and over, one of the two. Right, let's stop yapping, let's get some baits out, happy days. Right then, first bait check. Now this has a very long soak on it, to be fair. But let's, uh, let's see what happens. Shoes and socks are off. Why not? Make the most of it. Smell everyone out. So this one's got the two hook loop on. Don't feel like anything. Absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? Stunning. I thought I'd get down here a bit earlier because obviously school's finishing and everything. With this weather, they'll want to definitely get down on the beach. Yeah, so I've got sand eels, rag, mackerel, squid and black. I uh, say so the conditions aren't great. Clear, sunny. I did think about uh, what was it, Hordle Cliffs. I don't know why. I just I just like Southbourne. I don't know. Is there something there? I uh, say so I'm fishing at range. I'm probably casting too far to be fair, but I don't know. I thought I felt a rattle then, it's probably just a grip lead. So, is that a fish? It is a fish. <laughs> Bass. Oh, I thought there was something there then. Oh well. It is what it is. <sighs> Happy days. Ah, cool. There we go. Nice little schoolie. Well, at least I haven't banked. Happy days. Right, let's go for the second rod. 
So this has got the free hook clip down. No, that doesn't feel like anything, but then I said that on the other rod, but no, this doesn't. So yeah, so a bass, tickety-boo. God, it's so hot. So bloody hot. Oh, and don't forget, check out Shane at Fishing Dorset Live. No doubt he's out and about tonight. He's the man for all this area. No, I don't think there's anything on here. Nope, nothing at all. Nothing. Bait's barely touched. That's that doesn't bode well. Just need a good blow now, stir things up I think. We might, might see something half decent. Still, got to be in it to win it. Can't have it always. Well, I'm just starting to get a few rattles. Probably a schoolie again, but uh, it's quite promising. I'm just about due a bait check. It's gone a bit quiet, but uh, you never know, it may have hooked itself. I didn't know I had the other one on there, so. Right, let's have a look. So the bites I was getting was on the free hook clip down. Got another guy just fishing up from me. Right then, let's have a look. What have we got? Might be a little bit of weight there. Yeah, definitely some weight there. Take your time, Dobbs. No rush. Don't want to bump it off. Just seems to be a little bit of tiny bit of that uh, grass weed. That's quite heavy now. Come on, what we got? That is quite heavy. Come on, what have we got? Come on. Oh, go on then. Oh, maybe I haven't. Haven't I? Hey, target achieved. And there we go. Target achieved, that's what I was hoping for. A mid-September little place. Get that in the sunlight. There we go. You see that? Beautiful. Tiny, tiny little place. <laughs> Those Sakuma little match pros are working their little tits off. Come on. Get my discorder, I think. But there we go. Happy days. <laughs> well, I have to say, well, happy ain't the word. Although it's only a tiny place, a 
place is a place and a target is a target. Now I didn't say what the target species that I was hoping for. Well you just don't want to do it do you? Otherwise you look like a right wally. So. Uh, we might have a little bit of weight on it. Not sure. So this is the two up loop. That was the three up clip down. I had the blades on. And at the moment I'm casting well on top of that. Well on top of the uh, sandbag that's out there. I think half, uh, high water's around sort of like 10.30 tonight, so I would like to think there's a ray around. Oh, uh, yeah, boy. Uh, I don't know if I've got a bit of weight there or not. Tiny bit of weed coming up. Have oh, I? Yeah, weed. You can see it on the lead or not. A little bit of weed. Bugger. Yeah, weed just slid down onto the, onto the rig. Nope. Nothing there. Bit of a tangle, that ain't good. That doesn't bode well. Right, bait up and get it to, get it back out there. Happy days. Well, I haven't had no rattles on that. Uh, excuse me, get sunglasses. Um, <clears throat> nothing on that, uh, that cast, but Let's have a look. No visible signs. Tide's, tide's running well now. Flooding, flooding hard to be fair. So. <clears throat> and no doubt there's <clears throat> quite a bit of weed running through that as well. Sun setting now nicely. Just feel the old temperature dropping well now. I've even put my shoes and socks back on. Nah, there's nothing on it. I think I've just picked a bit of weed up then probably in the bow <clears throat> when that tide's running round. <laughs> oh, he came, he saw, he conquered. Happy days are here again. I'm singing this just for you, Hugh, because I know it's winding you up. There you go, Hugh. Southbourne Place. <laughs> Uh, pleased with that, bring it on. Right, <clears throat> just gonna check the free hook uh, 
Flip down one. That's two plates now. Bring it on. but that could be weed. As I say, I haven't seen any bites on the, those two cars. Mm, doesn't feel like anything. Oh, I don't know. Is that a is that a little? Nah. Was it? Well, no, don't think so. Nope. Nothing that time. Still bits of weed there. Little that tiny bit of green shite. Right. Bait her up and get out. I'm not double patting tonight. Um, I've got my own reasons for that, uh, other than I can't be asked. <laughs> no, that's, no. Uh, I just didn't want to tonight. I'm happy just to bait up, wind in, just bait up and cast, so I'm happy with that. Well, time for another bait check. Probably start putting the bigger baits out, what I have done on this one. a couple of little couple of little rattles on the uh the free clip down so this has got sand deal the squid rat feels like something could be there but probably weed I guess I've caught me other line. I think I've caught me other line. Have I? What have I got in here then? I, I ain't got me other line, I don't think. Or have I? Oh, hello. Something's on the surface. Is it? I think I might have a ray here. Oh, I have as well. <laughs> oh dear Dobbs. How do you do it? What have we got? Painted. Oh. Around there, I'm gonna lift her over. There we go. Painted by design. Lovely in the in the bottom lip there. <laughs> oh dear! So that's two targets achieved tonight. We'll take a picture of him in a minute. Just want to get this rod back out. Happy days. Well, seems to be on a bit of a roll now. So that second target achieved. This one's been given a few nibbles but that certainly didn't feel like anything then 
but they're all coming at distance. The guy next to me hasn't had even had a bite yet, and he's been here just a little bit time after me, so it's certainly distance that's uh, proven the case tonight. Absolutely nothing on here. Here we go, what have we got now? <laughs> Black bream. Oh dear, oh dear Dobbs. Still going for it tonight. Happy days. Nice one. Put him back. Oh, that water's cold. Gone. Happy days. There we go. Lovely little place, number two. I'm gonna get my feet wet. And there it goes. And there goes the sun. Right. Let's get it back out ASAP. Right, let's have another check. So I'm down to sort of like half hour checks now as we're into darkness and uh, let's see what's occurring. There's a bit of weight on that one, straight away. What have we got on here? Uh, what rig have I got on this one? So I've got the two hook loop. I mean, definitely a lot of weight unless I'm dragging the other one in. No, looks good. Yeah, there's a lot of weight on this. Come on, what we got? Oh yeah, go on then. Yeah, a lot of weight. Uh, the guy along there just had a small little slip, a nice little sole. So, I don't know if that's kiting in a little bit over to the right there, looks like it is. Definitely got something I would say, there's the leader, what have we got? Come on, let's walk down here a bit. Watch your feet, Dobbo. Ah, the inaugural smooth hound. Oh, that's another species. There we go. Little schmunter. Look perfectly in the lower jaw there. Happy days. Right. A little bit of sludge out there on the on the line, but certainly livable. Right, so this one we're gonna So I'm fishing now doing worms on one and bigger baits on the other. So back on the old uh, free hook clip down and I didn't put that bloody leader knot over did I oh well let's uh, see if I can slice me hand a bit see if I can avoid the knot bad dobbo right right there's the leader right just past my thumb come on one two oh.
distance R us. Ratchet on. Oh, the line too tight. Cool, oh, right. So stopping and starting, let's uh have a check with this one then. That didn't. Little bit of weight, but nah. I'm not even gonna wind slowly on this one. So this one's had squid and squid and black rat. On and up and over. Get that over there. Thank you very much. No, not even touched. Right, let's get this one out. Happy days. <clears throat> well, the bigger baits have gone a bit quiet now. But I'm getting the odd rattle on the, the worm. Which isn't really surprising. Worms probably the best all-round bait you can get in it so but now I'm pleased with this evening it's uh, doing well I'm just ready to get up and uh, have a bait check don't even what's the time time is now 25 past nine. Oh god my back right what should we do for I'll tell you what I'm gonna do the fish bait first So this is double sand eel and squid wrap. All quiet on the western front on this one. Yep. Nothing even sat there with it. Strange really, because now is a good tide for getting another ray. So the next cast on the uh, Fish one will be squid and black rat. So I'm not going to hang around. You know when there's something on there on the bigger baits. Get her in, get it out. Uh, that guy there, he's just had his second sole. Quite a nice one as well, to be fair. Must have been a good pound, pound and a quarter, pound and a half even. Well sizable. See what well, that toy came in quick this afternoon evening. It really did fly in. There's the leader. Get that over there. Dobbs. Happy day. Look at that. Squid and sand eel is not being touched. Very strange. A little bit of that sludge out there. Right, let's see if the squid and black can improve things. Right, let's get it out there. Right, let's have a look at the what ones on this one. Oh, this one's uh, free up clip down now. Let's see. Has been rattling away, then maybe. Uh, possibly something there. Hmm. 
little bit of white. I'll tell you what, these TSRs are absolutely bombless reels. I get wet still though. There. I would definitely say there's something there. What have we got? Another species? There's the leader. I have felt it. Hey, hey. and another place. <laughs> no, it is. Uh, almost looks like a dab. Uh, I would say that's a dab, not a place. That almost looks like a dab. Although it doesn't look very... Yeah, I suppose it is a little bit see-through. That certainly doesn't look like a place. I would say a dab. Happy days. Oh, I'm pleased with that. Right. Let's get the two up loop out. Well, we've just had some nice bites on the worm rod. And that's the uh, two hook loop. The other rod, I've got a uh, squid and blacks wrapped. There it goes. Yeah, look at that slack line all over the place. Right, let's. Uh, yeah, go cool. Yeah, quite a bit of slack line there. It's been going for some time. Slack line. Yeah, a little bit of weight. I've really enjoyed it this evening. Quite a few species. Those Sakuma Mac hooks are absolutely fine wire ones are absolutely uh, superb. Nothing gets away from them. And all the hook lengths are uh, 20 pounds Sakuma fluorocarbon as well, so that's good. I've been using them out in the boat for the sole, but I've started using them for the snoods on the shore, and uh, they're brilliant. What we got? Something on it, bouncing away, I can feel it. There's the leader just coming up, and there's the fish. What we got? Oh, and we've got another. Oh, here we go. Wonder when the sole was going to make an appearance. Happy days. Ah, that's how Southbourne should be. As I say, it has been quiet this year, but... That is... There's another little slip there. Just under side, I would say, but... As I say, what I've been catching tonight is what you normally do get at Southbourne, so it's easy fishing, I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm whacking it far, but seriously, a shorter cast is more than ample for here. So, tickety-boo, right, I'm just taking a couple of pictures, get it back in, happy day. Right, I've decided to make that my last cast. Got one going on this, keeps giving me slack line been going for about 20 minutes I just don't want to waste me time 
doing an extra cast and this, that and the other, so I'll just let it. Yeah, there we go. A lot of weight on that. He's probably thinking, thank fuck for that, he's going to get me in. Yeah, I'm more than happy tonight. A few targets achieved. What we got on here? Can this be another species? Go on then. Yeah, go on. Rattle away, I can feel you. Yeah, brilliant evening to be fair. Really pleased with that. Everything's all come to plan. What we got? Oh, there we go. I felt you then. Good old rattle. Come on, Bobo. What we got? Oh, go on then. Go on. And again. There's the leader and there's the fish. What we got? Oh, nice soul. That's better. That's a better soul. That's a lump and half. Well sizable. Look at that. Taking both hooks, greedy git. Oh no, he ain't. No, he's foul hooked under the chin with that one, but he's taken that one. Oh, he's a lively little git. Nice. Come on. There we go. That's a nice sole. Approaching a pound. Oh shit. I ain't got me boots on, have I? <laughs> Nearly a wet foot. Here we go. Go on. There we go. Happy days. Uh, pleased with that. Right. Let's get her back out for the last time. Well, that's it, last bait check. What an evening, really enjoyed that. This is how Southbourne should be fishing. Lots of bits and pieces. Two targets achieved. Two place, one painted ray. That's what I was hoping for. And to be fair, a bonus dab as well, black bream. Yeah, really good evening. Pleased with that, lots of species. Right. Is that a good soak for the last time? Let's get her in. No. As I say, I ain't seen no bites this time. I'm not going to mess around, get it in quick. sand in it right check the worm one as I say I ain't seen no bites on this one so I'm not expecting anything to be on there let's have a look no nothing on there either a 
No hanging about, let's get a rinse. Nothing on there. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this evening. It's been a cracking evening, really enjoyed that. Lots of bits and pieces. That's all the fishing this weekend I'm going to be doing, so it's Friday evening. I've got to go to the pool and put a diesel eater in a cat. Sunday morning and that's it, work tomorrow, work before I go to pool and I'll probably go to work after I've been to pool, that's <laughs> about right. So we're launching a cat on the 2nd of October, 12 metre, happy days, still managing to squeeze some uh, fishing in, that's all that matters, but I hope you've enjoyed it, if you haven't already done so please hit the subscribe, hit the like button and share away if you don't mind and thank you for all your support uh, subscribers are just absolutely going for the roof so I'm really pleased with that uh, thank you all until next time that's uh, Bobo's Fishing Adventures out happy days isn't that right Hugh Right, there we go, <laughs> look at that, lovely little dab, beautiful, I haven't had a dab for many years, used to get them on sand down here during the daylight, during the day and everything, used to get two, three at a time on sand down here on the island. So you go, a nice little dab from Southport. Beautiful. Happy days. Isn't that right, Hugh? <laughs>